What's going on guys, Max here, back at it again with that Call of Duty news, and I can't, oh my god, I can't do that. Background gameplay guys, 116 kills for you on hardpoint, and yes, I am using the Dingo, but equally I do pick up guns, like I'm the one, like the one I'm about to pick up, like the VMP. So it's 116 kills during the Nuketown 24-7 playlist, and I really was enjoying Nuketown this weekend because of all the scrubs playing it, as it's been made available, well, it's free for everyone now as well, and I was also using Combat Focus, put Purifier away for a minute. So the other day, if you guys don't follow me on Twitter, I got about six or seven 100 plus kill gameplays with a nuclear in there as well. Um, so hopefully you guys enjoy that. But today there's been a lot of talk about Call of Duty. Um, I've got a Ghost 2 fan made trailer coming out. You guys should have earlier on, or earlier on, my computers and YouTube has been having difficulties uploading and so on. Earlier on you guys should, if it has uploaded, have seen a Ghost 2 confirm video. But in today's video I'm sort of... I'm speculating whether it actually will be Ghost 2. I mean, one minute I'm telling you guys it's going to be MW4, the next I'm saying it's not going to be MW4, then I say it's Ghost 2, then I say, then I tell you guys it's not going to be Ghost 2 or MW4, then I tell you it's Ghost 2, and then now I'm going to tell you it's going to be Call of Duty Space Warfare. What on earth should you guys believe? Well, where I'm getting this information from is an insider known as Shinobi602, who I debunked on Twitter, but he has been correct for the last three Call of Duties. Um, he said that basically Call of Duty 2016 will be set in space by Infinity Ward. And originally I thought, no, rubbish, it's never going to do it, even though Call of Duty have the name Space Warfare trademarked, as I've already spoken in a previous video, the exact same as they had Future Warfare trademarked. Future Warfare didn't happen, it actually turned into Advanced Warfare with Sledgehammer Games in 2014. Big failure there. So surely Space Warfare won't happen. Well, actually it looks like it may. So this insider has been saying that the next Call of Duty game will be set in space. There have also been numerous magazine articles um, saying this as well. And originally I didn't believe it, but then looking at Infinity Ward's Twitter and looking at their activity, I think we're going to be in space, guys. I'm saying it right now. It's going, probably going to be called Call of Duty Space Warfare, and we most likely will be in space. So back in the new year, this is where it started. They said, here's to 2016, something like, let's reach new heights. Originally, none of us thought anything, and there was a picture in the background of the space mission in Call of Duty Ghosts. So here we've got to ask the question, yes, or here we've got to say, yes, the campaign is somehow connected to Call of Duty Ghosts, because yet again, I'll say it on my channel once more, the Ghost campaign did end on a cliffhanger. So Ghost maybe was experimenting with space missions, and I think people liked it. So now they're going to continue with it. My Twitter's going off in the background as well, so um, uh, apologies for that as well. But So Ghost experimented with space, so now we're going to see a whole Call of Duty set in space. Now I know what you guys are saying, but Max, you told me that um, Activision also owned Destiny, and that's set in space. So how on earth will Call of Duty be in space? I don't know. It's the simple question. I'm completely confused, guys. There have been loads of leaks, um, more so than usual for this Call of Duty. For Black Ops 3, it was fairly obvious it was going to be Black Ops 3 because of how big a success Black Ops 2 was. But now for this game, Ghost wasn't a success. We know that the future setting hasn't been successful. But when looking at the Infinity Wars Twitter, it becomes clear. So when I went, so first of all, we had this thing: re, uh, let's reach new heights. Heights is in space. Then I looked at Infinity War Jobs Twitter with only 400 and so followers, but it's their actual job Twitter uh, for anyone recruiting people who want to work for them. And this page is following numerous people. So I originally joked and said, oh, ha, ha, it's following High Moon Studios people. I think so, uh, they helped with Destiny or something. Uh, that means it said in space, and I joked about that. But then looking further down the list, I saw they were following a bunch of game developers such as Rockstar, Raven, and um, people like that. But then they were randomly following NASA, and that was one of the most recent people they followed, of the 28. Why are they following NASA? Who knows? That could be another thing. Um, then another interview, there was an interview with Mark Rubin back in 2013, who worked for Infinity Ward then, then he left, then he joined again, and I think now he's left again. And he was basically talking about how they're allowed to do some things, but equally not allowed to do others. So he was saying, I think somebody asked him a question about, could we see a game set in space? He said, yeah, we could. That's another thing. And then another thing was when Infinity Ward said, or when Activision in their conference, press conference around a month and a bit ago, I think end of January or in February, you guys will remember this, they said the title was a new and innovative one. So when we look at all these things and put them all together, I would have had the screenshots on screen for you guys hopefully in this video throughout, so you're not, so I haven't lost you at all. When you look at all these things, new, innovative, could we see it in space? Yes. Um, 
here's to new heights, then they're following NASA. Could it happen? Could we be seeing Call of Duty said in space? And then the icing on the cake was the insider known as Shinobi602 who said it will be in space and it's set in the future. What do you guys think about this? I'm at a complete loss. I, If it's set in space, I'm tempted not to even buy the game. And, uh, you know, Black Ops 3 is good for me to be playing for the next two years because I've got no faith in Sledgehammer at all. All I want is just a game set in the past. And surely Call of Duty should know everyone has been asking for a game set in the past and they're not delivering it to us, and I don't know why. What do you guys think about this? Let me know down below all of your thoughts in the comment section. The most likely title for this game at the moment is going to be Call of Duty Space Warfare. Ah, my god. I'll see you guys over on the next video. Jesus Christ, they not honestly listen to us fans. Like, us fans, just, we all tell them we want a game set in the past, and what are they going to do? They bloody make a game set in space. Oh my god. Easy. But if you close your eyes